Hello, and welcome to another episode of the research page. In this episode, we were actually going to open with the Harlem Shuffle. However, I thought that there was enough King Kong and Godzilla videos on the internet to uh, more than compensate for me going around and doing this stuff. Now, moving on. What we're going to take a look at this episode is Curve Track. Unfortunately, I couldn't do a time lapse of the machining process and some of the assembly. And I did say that this channel would chronicle any of the, how do you say, miscues that we came up on. Um, in the original creation of this track, I did have a couple of setbacks. I have to go and try a different schedule of PVC pipe. However, you will get to see um, the photographs, uh, what we have done up until the point at which he man myself could not turn around and complete the task. Uh, next week, we will be going ahead again and taking a second swing at this. In the meantime, I did find an alternative as I was trying to get past the shortcomings that we had. Um, you should see that picture now. And I'll be doing some more on that as well with the next episode. Hopefully that's a good alternative to flex track. Addition to the arch track. We received a bit of a duel. Uh, a said individual had turned around and challenged me that a 5D Mark II could in fact be used comfortably with a gearbox. Lucky enough, Gearbox has gone and thrown a 33% off sale, in which I took advantage of to buy a second GB2. We're going to be actually showing you a unboxing of said GB2, and we're going to give this a whirl and see if the 5D with a 35mm Rokinon can fit comfortably in this apparatus. Here we go. Thank you for watching another episode of the research page. If you like what you've seen so far, comment, rate, and or subscribe. See you next Monday with another episode.